Konnichiwa guys. My name is Rohit Shiv Prasad and I'm the founder of RSP in Japan. Yaar abhi tak agar subscribe nahi kiya hai to kar do. Itni mehnat kar raha hu main tum logo ke liye. Itni information deta hu. Yaar kar do yaar sharma kyun rahe ho? Kar do. Chhodo. Now in today's video I am going to talk about the scope I have been getting a lot of questions. जब भी भी मैं कोई लाइव वेबिनार करता हूँ I get these questions. What is the scope for mechanical engineer? What is the scope for IT engineer? I want to do machine learning. What are the scopes? What are the scope? क्या job opportunities है क्या होगा क्या नहीं होगा ठीक So today's video is going to be about that. So watch the video till the end so that you can understand everything about it. This video is going to be the one that I will call a on-demand video. So, guys, the scope for you in Japan. Well, since I'm an engineer, I'm gonna start with that. Now, you know that Japan is a technologically driven country. Technology is very far ahead. And you might also know, if you don't know, so there are uh, there is a commitment where Japan needs around about two lakh. 50,000 engineers by the year 2025 there is some sort of news like that when japan is trying to hire engineers now you need to understand no matter what sort of engineer you are if you are an engineer you have a lot of scope but let me answer a few specific questions that i got through comments or uh, on instagram it's like uh, people are asking me what is the scope of a mechanical engineer here in japan i am a mechanical engineer so what i did was completed my mechanical engineering from india from a very basic university and i came to japan studied language and then i planned or decided to go for uh, masters i deviated from my motive i came here to get a job but then i thought it would be better to do masters now you might be knowing that japan is out there on the top when it comes to automobile industry automobiles if you are aware includes combustion engines then uh, aerodynamics so and then uh, the dynamics of the vehicle then suspension strength of material material now you being a mechanical engineer if you are good in thermodynamics or you have interest or want to do job for that maybe you can come here and work on fuel cells or some see the type of job that you will get here is going to be research and designing designing is the one that you would do the most once you are coming here also now ai and everything is catching the trend so machine learning and ai or robotics is also gaining a lot of popularity here see what type of job will you get if that is the question i can't answer that yeah i can tell you that you are going to be in the research and development department or you are, you are going to get a post which says engineer like maybe robotics engineer or mechanical engineer or designing engineer or maybe designer so you are going to get that tag well when it comes to automobile engineering i told you all the sectors if you are a mechanical engineer you can go for maybe you are good at fluids you can go for aerodynamics if you are good for like anything this is my own personal interest that's why i'm telling you let me just move on to it engineers or computer science engineers well you guys have scope anywhere in the world even in india you guys are the ones that are getting most of the jobs at this time if you are a robotics engineer or if you are a programmer or maybe a website developer anything if you develop anything on the computer your scope is equal anywhere so when it comes to scope I think I have answered you if you are an engineer. You have a lot of scope here. I don't know if that helps you but that's how it is. If you want to talk about nursing, well nursing is getting another popularity or there is a great demand of nursing students or nurses. That is because the older population in Japan is increasing. There is starts and things like that. So you need to understand that if you are a nurse or pursuing your career in that field opt for japan because here you can work as a nurse and the demand is increasing day by day yet 
it's very obvious it's because of the increase in older population then let's talk about management well first of all if we are talking about management scope there is again a lot of scope because people are working here now you have to understand that there is a great demand for people who can speak in english japan is very isolated because of many reasons and yet again japanese a language barrier so if you know english and you can connect them to foreign countries you are in demand no matter if you're an engineer or anything there are many foreigners who are working for universities or maybe language institutes they help the students outside or the students who are inquiring they do the documents and documentations and everything like that and there are many posts like that i'm not aware of these posts uh, specifically but yes there are a lot of scopes like that then if i talk about the marketing and sales well if you are interested in that your japanese should be way fluent so if your japanese is not fluent you have zero scope if your japanese is fluent you can do anything here in japan and marketing can be the best one for you i hope it answers a lot of questions for you but let me tell you one very specific thing if you are coming to japan from your country and trying to apply for a job you might not be given that preference or if you are coming from from a very good university from your country then you'll have a good chance otherwise it is suggested or i would suggest that study or graduate from a university or school anything here in japan then you have a lot of scope and it gives you time to adjust to the environment and thing there are a lot of people who are going to tell you that japanese is not required there are a lot of people who are going to tell you you can apply directly you can do that there is always a chance for that but again the chances are very low it's going to be narrow and you don't want to do that you don't want to waste time so if you are interested about knowing the scope i am not the person to ask to but i am getting someone a friend of mine is working in a robotics company he is designing robots so i am calling him for a live interview that is going to be on 17th of this month 17th april 2021 make sure that you attend this live webinar you can ask him anything even i am going to ask him a lot of questions because i even i want to know so feel free to join the webinar is of course free it's going to be live on youtube uh, the ones that i have been conducting sort of like that information is for you guys so if you like this video and if you like the information that i share please subscribe and if you like the video hit the like button and if you have any questions comment or you can reach out to us through instagram or any of our social handles so i hope i have answered you if i have not i will try to do my research and let you know as much as possible thank you